Lenly Transport. Lanley Transport is a mod that gives you innovative turn-of-the-century, old-timey, but vanilla-friendly tools for adventure. You can ride vehicles by right-clicking them and get off with Crouch. All motor vehicles need coal and water to run. After that its fuel supply will be displayed while riding and above the vehicle when close to it. To ride as passenger in a vehicle with multiple seats, craft the back seat cushion and place it near the vehicle. If you happen to find a lonely gas station on the way, make sure to refuel and pay the clerk a visit. There is a new villager inside, and will trade new items with you. To upgrade a basic motor coach to a passenger or freight motor coach, crouch right-click on it with either a minecart or a chest in hand. Vehicles provide a good amount of protection from shots and hits, you can repair them with iron ingots, simply crouch right-click on it with iron ingots in hand, but they can be damaged and eventually get destroyed. If you can't save your vehicle anymore, Try to get away from the spot because it will go with a hefty bang. Normal road-going vehicles like the motor coach are faster on paved ground and slower on natural terrain like snow, grass, sand or gravel. The track crawler is slower overall but isn't affected by different terrain and can climb inclines of one block, while the others need slabs to scale hills and uneven terrain. The track crawler can be equipped with a cargo sleigh that can carry a huge load of items and one passenger. It can be linked and disconnected from the crawler to be stored elsewhere. You can now say goodbye to slapping the ground with a shovel or a hoe, drive the new roller engine. With it you can pave roads or plow new farmland with ease. This mod also provides water vehicles, there are two types of steamboats, you can choose the color you like. Compared with cars, boats has a more refined model. An airship's climb and descent rate are controlled by looking upwards or downwards while flying. They consume fuel to stay in the air, even without a crew. So make sure to not leave them hovering for too long. An airship also has two types, the red one is smaller, but has better vision. While flying, you can use the mouse to control the camera for easy takeoff and landing. Additionally, the mod also adds some structure. If you fly high enough, you might find sky islands. There is only a lone iron golem on the island, perhaps as inspired by castle in the sky. Next is the weapon section, this mod adds some guns. Weapons have descriptions to show which type of ammunition they use. Pistols and automatic weapons use magazines while rifles and shotguns need individual cartridges. The TNT launcher uses blocks of TNT as magazines. You can even use a police beacon emergency kit to airdrop a squad of fearless guardians to help you in an emergency. In addition, there is a weapon called the question mark, which is extremely powerful to use. Finally, the mod adds 10 retro-inspired outfits, and some with special set effects. Such as the diving set allows you to breathe underwater, but is very heavy, making it difficult for the wearer to move quickly. Cob Lemon Info Coblemon Info is an add-in mod for Coblemon that adds useful visual information through mods such as Jade and JER. Configurable Pokemon tooltips are added thanks to Jade. Pokemon drops are now displayed within JER's mob drops catalog. Finally, you can view the charge progress of healers. Dimensional Anchor With Dimensional Anchor installed, a lodestone will actually be useful. You can place a lodestone on your base and right-click on it with a compass. Now, not only will the compass point to the lodestone as usual, but if you use it again, you will be teleported right next to the lodestone it was connected to. But there is some risk involved if using it when XP is not enough. You may be injured and teleported to other dimensions. Anku This mod reworks Totem of Undying. Similar to a compass, you can now right-click on a lodestone with your totem to link it. When you die with a linked totem in hand, not only it will save you from death, it will also teleport you to the location of the lodestone. If you use it in another dimension, it will teleport you back to the linked dimension. Mine Spawners Mine Spawners is a server-side mod. The mod allows you to obtain spawners using a silk touch pickaxe and place them wherever you want.
Attack Structure Architect. Structure Architect is a mod that aims to upgrade dungeons and villages. All the links are in the description, have fun!